You're watching Teens Do Not Talk! Hooray! <laughs> what field do you need to take to become a fish expert or a fish scientist? Hi Chantel, uh, my name is Lorian and I'm a fishery scientist uh, here at SPC. But there are actually many options to get to work on tuna or fisheries in the Pacific. First, you could study biology or math, chemistry or natural resources and become a scientist or a lab technician or you could be a port sampler or a fisheries observer. You could also study law and become a legal advisor or a fisheries economist. You could also study computer science and become an app developer or a database manager. Just to highlight that, um, we are many women here at the Pacific community working on fisheries. So let's meet some of my colleagues. My name is Nan, I'm a fisheries scientist. My name is Elodie and I'm a senior research officer. My name is Aurélie and I am a senior fisheries technician. My name is Pauline. My name is Vanille. And, and we, we are research, research assistant. assistant. My name is Jennifer and I'm finishing my fishery science degree. I'm Tarina. I'm Elizabeth. I'm Sabrina. I'm Giovanna and we are the data control technician. My name is Ellen and I am fisheries administration officer. My name is Natalie and I am an administrative assistant. My name is Ariella D'Andrea and I'm a fisheries lawyer. My name is Valerie and I'm a fisheries research scientist. I know it could be confusing to have that many options, but if you're passionate about uh, tuna and oceans, there's going to be something for you. The possibilities are just endless. As our colleagues in SBC have noted, there's plenty of opportunities for men and women right across the sector. In fact, in our organisation, we have women working at all levels, in all departments, um, right up to our Director General. 